For the boom adjustments, the first adjustment that we'd like to make would be for the boom lead. That is how far forward or back the boom is in relationship to the machine and to the back rack. To adjust this, we will adjust it at the back rack, but first we must sight down the tube of the boom to see how much adjustment would be needed. Then we can make this adjustment at the back rack. To adjust the boom lead, what we want to do first is to loosen the adjuster clevis on the back rack. Loosen these two bolts on the adjuster clevis, and then we can use the all-thread adjustment bolts to move the boom forwards or backwards in relationship to the back rack. Once this adjustment is made, it's very important that we retighten these bolts and torque them to 420 foot-pounds when your adjustment's completed. The next adjustment we'll talk about will be the boom sway adjustment. This is how much the boom will sway as we go through the field. What we want to do first to adjust this is to loosen the lock bolt, and then we will adjust the set bolt to get the desired amount of gap between the steel tube and the wear pad. We're going to do these at each four corners of the back rack. This will be the bottom, then this will be the top, and we'll also have a top and bottom on the opposite side. Once we are done adjusting this, then we will rock the boom back and forth to make sure we have the appropriate amount of sway. The next adjustment we'll do will be the tip cylinder adjustment. What we want to do is to try to even out the inner boom with the intermediate boom, but not put too much force on our cylinder. We want the end result, we want to have the boom cylinder to be able to easily move back and forth, but not too much so, just like we illustrate here. This adjustment is made by these set bolts. What we'll first do is loosen the set nut, and then we will adjust the bolt until we get the proper level from the inner boom to the intermediate boom and then not too much resistance with the tip cylinder. The next adjustment we will do is a brake back adjustment. Our object here is to get the brake back straight with the rest of the boom. We can do that by loosening the set nut on the adjustment bolt and then adjusting the bolt to get the proper alignment between the brake back and the intermediate boom. Once we're done with that, we can check to make sure that the boom comes back straight.